Alright, so welcome back to another Watch Dogs video. So this one is going to be all about the first responder which dropped in the May update, uh, the May 4th update, along with the DJ. I mean, they said the DJ, they list, um, list him on their sort of um, advertising material. Uh, on Twitter they had a big banner on there saying that there's two new characters, DJ and first responder. But the DJ is not a new character, I can tell you that. It's, it, the DJ's been in the game since pretty much day one, although he has been revamped with some awesome new skills, which I'm gonna cover. I really wanna try these guys out in multiplayer because I think the DJ and first responder would really complement each other. Um, DJ has uh, an awesome skill which uh, shortens cooldowns. I'm just gonna quickly check that one. I'm not even gonna swap out, but if we go here, short cooldowns, more damage. Short team's ability cooldowns. That's the key word, team's ability cooldowns. So you could use him with the first responder. Uh, first responder has an awesome shield, which basically tanks all the hits. So AR, sh uh, AR medical shield, active diagnostic limits damage. It says limits damage. Basically means it just completely tanks it and absorbs all the damage. Um, I'm going to show you now actually uh, if I can get a drone, a cargo drone, and I will quickly bring that up. Huh. Eat your fucking eyes check mate, alright, so I'm going to quickly show you how this tanks damage, and it also tanks lethal damage, well it tanks all, all damage basically, for a limited time, so we're going to head up on this cargo drone as far, uh, pretty much, almost as far up as we can. There we go, we're as, we're as high as we can possibly go. So, if we activate it, jump off, bam, dunk, see? Tanks all damage. And that bar, you can see go down, when that goes down, uh, the cooldown's gone. So now if we check, we have a 1 minute 39 is the cooldown timer on there. Um, so I want to be testing this with a DJ uh, in multiplayer. So if, a D if we got a DJ in co-op, activate that shield. I'm going to be testing that to see just how uh, quick the, the cooldown is with the DJ. But... Um, yeah, so there's that good. It, it, it just basically <coughs> self-explanatory. It will just take all damage until that bar reaches zero. Then you have to wait for the cooldown. You can um, you can literally transfer it briefly to another player. So um, I'll wait for the cooldown to stop anyway. Uh, I want to go to a um, restricted area because I want to try his melee weapon. I personally think it is um what's this one? Julie House Crescent Park. <coughs> I personally think it it's basically the same as a crowbar which you can get on characters normally. Um just reskinned. So we're going to do a little bit of combat just to... Uh, do, I did this in my last live stream, but uh, we can do it again. Uh, just a little quick demonstration. I'll actually wait till the cooldown's finished. Well, we'll go in there. We'll test, the, we'll test it out. Come on, bitch, bring it on. I am... Oh, she blocked then. So I did, they did block, I can't, 
tell if oh oh no 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 what the fuck damn let's quickly swap out i think i have another one prepped and ready to go uh, unless he is still uh no he's good he's good to go he, he was just um recently arrested but we uh or injured but he came back pretty quick so I have these ones with physically fit. They do come with other sk uh, third skills. I've never seen them with a fourth. And I've profiled quite a few of them. Let's go back in there. I am finished with you girls. I will not end it. Uh, you must fight. Oh shit, I've used the button prematurely. By mistake. No. You're gonna get a fucking slap boy, and enemies seem to be more, at least in hard difficulty, seem to be um, countering as well. They actually counter sometimes, which I never noticed them doing that in regular. And they're more, look, they're more fucking hell, man. Um, they're more uh, sort of, uh, I can't think of the word, uh, persistent. Right, he didn't really block. So more enemies, please. Oh, he's dead. There's got to be more. Oh, she's nearly dead anyway. In your face, sweetheart. In your face. Oh, that was an adversary as well. Come on, this uh, might have to go to another restricted area. Oh, there's another one. I don't want to counter him. I just want to. I want him to block. He will not block. Oh, I'm going to wait till he gets up again, actually. I think it's exactly the same damage. I think he blocked a couple of times and I oh know he's nearly down. Let's finish him off. Yeah, I I think it's basically a reskin version of Crowbar. I have to test that out a little bit more, but um, unfortunately no lethal weapons, but um, it does come with a standard dead sec issued um, gear. Uh, so if we go into weapons. Yeah, it's just the standard stuff. I should give him those two. I prefer those two, really. Um, actually, let's reskin those while we're here. Gotta give him those ones. I like that one. So, not really much else to say about the, um, the first responder. I've, so, we've done ta tanks full damage. Tank basically all types of damage. Um, from what I can tell, heavy heavy melee weapon, hydraulic rescue tool. Um, from what I can tell, it is just a reskin crowbar. And uh, third skill, never seen them with fourth. Third skill can I've seen them with um, guitar, harmonica. I've seen them with um, the I think tough drunk. The one way does more damage, more drunk. Um, and also I've seen him with the uh, takes less damage while drunk, but to be honest, I think that's better of the two. Um, they have come with some others actually. And sometimes they only come with two. So you sometimes you see them with two, sometimes you'll see them with three. Uh, never seen them before. So that's all I can think of um, to showcase with the first responder. As I said, uh, when I do my next live stream, I'll be tackling some online, which will be the first time I've been online on this game since the update. So that'll be all new because 
there's some new missions apparently so I'm looking forward to that anyway um, that's it actually while we're here so let's check out his other costumes that's what I wanted to show you as well um, the only other thing I want to show you is the other type of first responder uh, uniform that I've seen that profile picture will change when we go to the store uh, let's quickly go there actually I'm going to quickly head over here just to change that out and then I'm going to go back to Earl's Fortune there are other locations where you can find the first responder that don't um, have to go to Earl's Fortune to find them so as we, uh, Earl's Fortune is obviously the pub um, right above the safe house you can find them at St Thomas's Hospital which I think uh, there we go you can find them outside there protesting and I've also found them in the park uh, Titus Park um, you can get them with physically fit you don't have to go to the park to get that skill Let's just change his uniforms a bit, see what else he comes with. Get out of my way, uh, bus. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I just wet myself. Yes, my driving is still as shit as always. My outfits, so oh, okay. Too, oh, it's too dark. Can't really see anything. I cannot see anything here. Let's go around here. There we go. Dun, 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 dun. Outfit. So his default outfit is like uh, okay. That little uh, cool chain thing, like the jacket. Uh, that's the one I found uh, while he's in Titus Park, and that is his his uh, first responder outfit. And those two are from. Uh, that's uh, the um, Mina costume, basically, which I won't put him in that. And that one, I nah. That's not for me, I'm afraid. Uh, I do like that one. Um, oh, we have to change him first. Then the then the profile picture should change. And if we go back, it should change out again. So let's head over to Elle's Fortune. Uh, let's make sure that's changed. Yeah, there we go. Back to how it should be. Um, right, Elle's Fortune. I just want to show you the other first responder. You probably got, you guys have probably seen it anyway, but those that you have that happen to spawn in um, with that one so yeah AR shield is pretty awesome I like it oh and I'll show you you can um, transfer it to other people which is going to be excellent in co-op as well so I guess if you've got someone hacking that needs to hack it it's like a hacking mission in co-op and they're getting swamped you can um, if you've got like a team of say two other responders um, so I think the perfect team, um, a support team, uh, support role in online is maybe have two responders and a DJ and then you can have one responder, oh, one minute, let me finish talking, so you can have one, so say that's another player, you could do that, give them the shield, right, and then have a DJ next to you sort of um reducing the cooldown of your shield uh, so you could you guys could be sort of like hiding and if they're doing a hacking mission or something and then when that shield goes the other responder could give her the shield as well and then um do it like that so they they would play a really good supporting role i think in online um So yeah, let's quickly go to Earl's Fortune. Yeah. 
There's DJs um, outside here. I'll definitely um, cover them in another episode. So that's the first responder. See, a junk. Um, we'll do this a few times so you get to the, just to seeing what um, skills they actually come with. If they don't appear in that position, I tend to just walk out the door, the front door, then go back in again, and usually one will spawn in again. So let's go back. I'll do this until I get one of the others to spawn, uh, the one that has a different visor. Personally, I like this one uh, better. Uh, it just covers the whole face, and when you're doing infiltrations and missions and stuff, it still keeps the, the helmet. So they're not there. Let's go back out. Let's go back in. Hopefully he will spawn in. Let's try again. Oh, there's another DJ there, come on. Right, okay, so we've got another one that's the same. See, only two. I like the DJs that have the gold jacket. Um, right, let's try this again. don't really want to take this, um, uh, make this video too long. Uh, so hopefully we can get one come up now. Okay. She's got different pants. I'm sure she's got different pants to the other DJ I've got. Yeah. There we go, there's the other type. So, I will, uh, have I got room to profile? I haven't got room to profile, but I'll try and move in closer. Just get the gist of it. She's got like a, a camera on the side. Oh, he's got one as well, okay. It's basically the same top part of the, it's the same helmet, but just the bottom is, uh, the bottom half is, um, he doesn't have the breathing apparatus. <clears throat> so that oh and the other skill I've seen that you can get with this one um, that's the other third one I've seen uh, so that was pretty much it um, I haven't shown much of the shield uh, basically because it's um, you know self explanatory it just takes all the hits you know we're going to quickly go in there get another combat thing started and then I'll end the video. But I hope you guys get a, a bit of a better idea whether it's worth having one. Definitely worth having one. And um, it would create some interesting um, gameplay uh, in online, especially in co-op. I'm not sure how that's going to work in the PvP of the game when it comes out. Because <laughs> if you have PvP, you just, you just activate your shield and just... I kind of um, kill the other player. To me, it would seem pretty overpowered if you timed it right. right let's just go in here this way. So you could have like a, a co-op mission, say, for example, DJ's here. DJ could use his skill where he stuns everybody, and then you just activate his shield and just... Um, destroy everyone basically. Yeah. Oh god. Fool! Come on. Let me get a few licks in. I mean, what I've noticed with this weapon is they don't tend to block. Oh fuck. I think we'll have the shield. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. He's tanking. Ow. 
After some of that, bitches. Two down, one to go. And then, of course, I've got my shield as a backup. Because I don't have a, a gun drawn, they're gonna, they're not gonna shoot me. Um, I should try out the. Hold on, let's try. It. Oh no, 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 no! That's probably not a good idea. Um, I should wait for the shield to. Oh. Shit, no, not good. That's not good. Evasive maneuvers. Oh shit, we're dead. One. I just want to activate it with uh, them firing at me just to see, uh, just show you how it tanks just literally everything. Um, I think the other one might still be knocked out. Yeah, definitely on hard difficulty. They, the, um, they are definitely the enemies are a little bit more challenging I think we'll, we'll head out the area and come back so we respawn uh, those guys those enemies your comrade is now taking an Albion mandated timeout you're up I got you bags let's go finish up what they started Should be fine. No, he's not going to get the gun out, is he? So the police just run off. They like they never ran off before. No, okay. See, look, now they counter. So if you if you try and yeah, he's gonna be dead. Oh, just, yeah. But you get the idea. Literally, uh, all damage just gets um gets tanked. Another thing, like normally when I used to hit them with a the gun, they would just stand there. They would t sometimes they would dodge roll out the way. But now what they do is they'll grab you and they'll push you away as well. So yeah, that's it for this one. Um, just a little bit of gameplay on um, the first responder. I will do one on the DJ. Um, and yeah, so that's it. Anyway, um, as always, thanks for watching. I will catch you in the next one. Stay safe and look after yourselves.